Good morning! I got this on Amazon. This thing, finally, because I want to try it. And I want to see if it's working. I have to go to the doctor's today again, because I'm going every two weeks now. So I did, I washed my hair this morning, and now I want to do this, put it in, and then I don't have to leave for a couple hours. So hopefully, you're supposed to leave it overnight, but I'm just gonna try it like for a little bit and then see how it is. So let's just go ahead, try the thing. I'm gonna put my instructions right there. It comes with this little claw clip. Oh, that's a nice one. Two rubber bands, two hair clippers. Put this here. You just wrap it around there. Oh wait, you take your scrunchie, I mean your thing, okay. And then I'm just supposed to like take my hair and wrap, take my hair and wrap it around here. Like that, I guess. I think it's looking good. Now on to the next one. That's how she's looking. Hopefully this works, cause this would be like a game changer for like a mom. Because most of the time I just like do my hair. However, because I'm just too lazy to do it we're gonna let this sit i'm gonna do my makeup and start my day okay so i have had this in for like i don't know three hours and it's like coming out i feel like next time I think like the more you get used to it, like the better you'll get at it. Now it's just like falling out or whatever. So we're gonna take this out because I gotta leave here soon. I feel like if I would have left it in overnight, I should have done this last night. If I let it dry like this, it should look good, right? But you can tell it would have looked amazing if I would have let it in longer. But now I'm just, I'm just gonna leave it like that. I just went to the thrift store and I got out. I got two bags of some things. I found some clothes for me, which is amazing because I needed some clothes and I'm pretty happy with it. I'll show you guys later then what I got. But right now, I am currently going to the Walmart. I need to pick up a few things at Walmart. And after my doctor's appointment, I'm going to go to Marshall's and find a shirt for my husband because we have a photo shoot on Saturday and I need to find him a shirt. He has pants already. All we need to find is the shirt. Got out of the doctor's. The baby's doing good in the hood going crazy she said so okay i think i'm gonna give up like going to stores to find like baby things because nobody has anything i feel like i'm better off just ordering it online because i have been to a couple stores already nobody has anything like as simple as a crib mattress nobody has any so i don't know i think i'm just gonna go call it a day and go order my stuff online um i have eight more week no nine more weeks nine more weeks until my due date so i feel like i need to um order it right now so it comes but i got this at tj maxx i'm afraid it explode because i dropped it It's okay. It's just all right. But you guys, I'm just gonna head home now. I'm tired of it.
tired of looking and not finding anything. I don't like going in stores and looking and looking and then you don't find anything. I feel like I'm better off just ordering it online and then doing the thing there. So that's what I'm about to do. Good morning, guys. It is the next day. Me and Olivia on our, are on our way to buy. What are we on our way to buy? fish because her pet Goldie Dad. just died. She did not make it. We got her at the fair and I could tell when we brought her home that she was just not doing the best. And he, and he was not even doing stuff. Yeah, he wasn't swimming at all. He wasn't doing anything. He didn't eat. So I pretty much knew he wasn't going to make it. So that fish didn't make it and Olivia was pretty sad. She was crying, but I think she's... Are you okay now? She's okay now. We prayed for the fish and then he went up to heaven to swim with his fish buddies in heaven, right? Yeah. So now we're on our way to the pet store to get some more. We got the fish. We just got these little guppies. She said those are good just to like, till your tank is like better established and stuff. So we got a bunch of little guppies. I think we got six of them, right? There's a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, seven. Nine, I see seven. Eight, nine, ten. There's ten of them. Ten? Those are adorable. Now let's go home and put them in our tank. Okay. Okay, let's pour them in. Ready? One, two, three. Guppies. I have to bring them all the ones around. Here they are. Huh? Oh, guppies. I think they want some food. How cute. Mom, can you give me no, she said we can't feed him today. She said two, one time a day. Two times a day? But mommy said poor. So I got some things yesterday at TJ Maxx. Um, just because I wasn't in the mood to go to like Sephora or Alta or any other store to get like makeup stuff. So I just got these from Beauty Concepts. I needed mascara because I have a photo shoot on Saturday. I have a photo shoot, so I gotta, I had to get like some new things, you know? So I got some mascara. I hope this is good. I'm gonna try it out. And then I just got me these press-on nails because I have just been doing press-ons lately. So I got me these press-on nails. I thought this would be cute in pictures. I needed some lash glue, so I got that. Got me these pair of sandals. I just needed some little dress sandals, and I thought those were so cute. And then also got me just this thing of nail polish. This is for my toes because I cannot let anybody do my toes. Like, I did them for my wedding once, that was the first and probably the only time in my life that I will be getting my toes done because I cannot take it. Like, please don't touch my feet. So, got that to do my toes. And then I just got these little socks for the little baby because I don't have socks yet. And I'm slowly starting to just like buy stuff when I see it and I go out. So you guys, I want to show you a couple outfits I got yesterday that I think are so, so cute. And I just want to show you guys. So the first one was this cute little dress. I thought it was so adorable. It's very long and it looks so cute with the bump. Like, I just love it. It has pockets, which is another amazing quality. And I don't know, it just, the blue just gives me like boy, since I'm having a boy, just gives me like these boy vibes. It gives me very much like, 
boy mom. I don't know, I like it. I literally have nine weeks left, so we're getting down to the wires here, but I thought this was cute pregnant dress. Very cute. Okay, the next one is this black shirt. It's just a black shirt, and I thought it would be cute. Go with this skirt. I got this skirt as well. I'm looking for more like comfortable pregnancy outfits, so I thought this skirt with like a shirt, and I don't have any black shirts that look very good right now, so I had to get a black shirt, and I thought this one goes very cute with this little skirt. The skirt is very nice and flowy. It feels very comfortable. And then just, I will just tuck this shirt in, you know, all the way around, pull it all the way up. And it will look like this. I think it's so cute. Very, very comfortable, very airy. Like I won't get too warm in it. So I thought this one was another cute one. Now these two, I'm not going to put together. I'd probably just put like a normal white shirt with this skirt, but I wanted to show you guys this cute shirt I got as well. I love these flowers. It just looks so, so cute. I love this shirt. So I just put it with this for now, but then I also got this skirt. It has these cute buttons Then it has this slit here to let your legs breathe and stuff. I love this skirt, but I still am kind of like a little, I don't know. Sometimes it kind of throws me off a little bit, but but yeah, I don't know if it's just, I don't know if I like the, I don't know, I don't know. I might just have to find something that I like better than this top to go with it, but I think the skirt, mm, I don't know, it's cute, but it just, it's just something that I am like, I wouldn't feel like, oh my gosh, I love it in. You know what I mean? I think it might be a tad bit too big, but I felt like in the store it would look so cute. And now I just feel like it makes me look huge. Like, wait, my stomach is actually huge. But I think the buttons, I think the buttons throw me off a bit. All the buttons down the front might make it look a little odd or maybe it's the polka dots I don't know whatever it is I'm not the biggest fan okay then I got this I actually love this color on me and I would never normally like buy something like this trendy or whatever but right now I really just don't care anymore I mostly always go just like basic very black, white, nude, plain stuff. And I've been thinking, like I need to start, like I'm ready for some, something colorful, you know, a little different things. But, so I got this shirt. I think it is cute. And I also got these biker shorts. These are so, so comfortable. They come like all the way up here, which I love. And they're so comfortable, like everywhere. They feel like butter. And I feel like this shirt with these little biker shorts look cute. Like, mm, looks very flowy. Looks cute. I also got a pair of just these black leggings, pregnancy leggings. I think this stuff comes from Amazon because they're both like the same brand and they both feel so, so amazing. Like if I could find this, it has no brand name or anything on it. It's just like this on there, but this, these like leggings are like so comfortable, so comfortable. And these biker shorts as well, they're just like, they fit everything so well, so, so good. Then I had to go simple again, cause sometimes you just need like an all black outfit to like run some errands and you need a big baggy t-shirt. And all my t-shirts are like not big and baggy because I haven't been pregnant in like four years. So everything I have is just like, you can't make it pregnancy. But this says, trust the word of God. It's just like one of those t-shirts that somebody printed, but I thought it was so cute. Like I love it. The black looks cute on the bump. I just, and I love trust the word of God. You know, I can just like, shh. 
share the word while I'm walking, you know? I thought it was cute. Very cute. Especially for like $2, I think the shirt was. I was like, give me that shirt, okay? Then I just got this shirt from Old Navy as well. It's just like a t-shirt, just a plain baggy t-shirt, but it's not as baggy on a pregnant woman. But I just like these t-shirts for when I'm not in the mood to wear a dress, I need to run to town really quick, go, you know, just like do random little things. Then I love like these bigger shirts, especially with like biker shorts. I think this looks so cute and very, very comfortable. If you're pregnant, you know, like, it's just, it's just giving. I'm at that point where I can't stop rubbing my belly for just unknown reasons. All of a sudden I'm just standing here like rubbing it and I'm like, girl, stop, okay? But anyways, love these shirts. This one's very comfortable. They're like good prices too. So yeah, just grab you a bunch of these old, old navy t-shirts with some biker shorts and the best thing ever to run errands, just lounge around your house in, all of that good stuff. So go get you one if you haven't and you're pregnant and you're looking for something cozy. I also just got some little baby clothes for little boy. It's just these. Um, this comes from Loved Baby. Loved Baby, whatever. And it is just one of these little sleepers. It has like this little foot gripper things, sleeves with this thing on it. So cute. I love it. And it's just zero to three basic thing. Then I also got him this, which I thought was so cute. It just says cool on it. These little knee pad things and it has this zipper. I thought this would keep him so warm. And this comes from Mini Bean. No idea where that's from, but yeah, that's cute to me. I got my daughter these little pair of shorts and then I got her these pants for this fall sometime. And then I just got three plain white t-shirts. They looked brand new to me and they were, I like them. Like they had these little buttons on the side, snaps on the side here. So they're easy to like open and close and change them out of it real fast. The one reason why I like like onesies like this is because if your kid like has an accident and all their poop goes, you know, everywhere, it's so much easier to open these and get them out of the poop than it is if you have to like strip it over their head. That is like my worst thing about if they have those messes is like if you have to take it off over their head. But with these, you can just like unbutton it and just like get them out, you know, without it going everywhere. So love these for that. But that is my haul from yesterday. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you leave me a comment down below of the places you like to shop for your kids or like newborn stuff. I have not even got close to getting ready and I feel I'm getting a little bit of anxiety now because I need to get ready and I feel like I just have so much stuff to get and I really just need to start getting it so I am ordering everything per something almost every day I try to order something and <sighs> we're getting there we're getting close nine more weeks and we'll have a little baby but I'm so excited you guys I thought when I got pregnant I was gonna do so much pregnant stuff you know I'm gonna have like all this time this pregnancy is flying by so fast. I can't even, like, I can't even do the things that I wanted to because it's going so fast, which I'm not going to complain because I actually love that. I hate when it feels like your pregnancy just drags and drags and drags and drags. So this one is just flying and I'm feeling very unprepared. So I need to start getting things ready, setting things up. I got the crib, which I'm gonna set up today. And I'm gonna put all his clothes by their sizes and stuff and see what I still need, because I know I still need some things. And then I still need a changing table and like a changing pad for sure. I need a rocking chair for upstairs and I need one for downstairs. Like 
in the living room area just so when I'm downstairs with him and I need to rock him so yeah I just have a lot of things to do but make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of my future videos and thank you guys so so much for watching my videos and staying subscribed to my channel I appreciate you guys so so much and I'll see you in my next video bye